Everybody, welcome back to the Breach of New Mania. Um, so yeah, we got things. Um, technically speaking, this should have been a bio scanner, but it seemed just stupid to do because uh, we have Slugnog. So you know, um, do we have AOE? We got the Gyre generator. Yeah, let's go deal with the barber boss. Like that, I guess, and then we'll see. Spider. It only has two move, so it can only get to here. His movement doesn't matter too much. Basically, if we put our mech, it's gonna be impossible to prevent our mechs from getting webbed, isn't it? Hmm. We don't have any deployables either. this and hope that he goes for this spot. Not sure if... Well, they will target the Renfield bombs, right? Oh, jeez. And then there's you. Push on self, so we do need to worry about that as well. We can't do anything fancy with that. But this blocks the spawn, kills the spider, so. It's funny. <laughs> Alright, four back on the field. Is gonna go here. Gets the kill, blocks the spawn. What's not to like? Alright, three Vecan Hive Warrior. Presumably. This is Island 3, so it's well, never mind. <laughs> hey, he blocks the spawn for us. That's always nice when that happens. <clears throat> if he stays there, we'll get an easy acid on him too. Well, we still have an easy acid on. <clears throat> we are gonna do that. Nothing beats an easy high warrior kill. Make sure to give us that pot though, Renfield Bomb.
Yes, Kern. Kill confirmed. It's like we know what we're doing or something. Crazy as that might sound. Um, can't kill you. Yeah, because the acid <clears throat> would push him out of the way. Oh well. Just go stand over there, I guess. And the pod brings us heat converter for the next mission. Well, next island. Uh, unarmed train is... Unar Why did I go with unarmed? No spider from the get-go, so at least there's that. I hope nobody goes for uh, GH4. Well, that would be annoying. So the gyre generator here is not as good as I was hoping it would be here. Can we do one more bump damage after this? Yes. the alpha. Mm, blocks a spawn though. No, I don't want to do that just yet. If we're not gonna get swarmed, I prefer not to block spawns. I'm probably gonna switch out uh, Slock Knock with Phoenix. So Slock Knock can level up a bit. Our spiders coming out here, huh? We'll prevent that. Blocking no spawns to blocking two. That's how quickly I can change my mind, apparently. But if it means we stop the spider from being a pain in the butt, then uh, I don't see any problems with it. I guess we don't have to switch Slock Nog out, just need to make use of his um, face cannon a bit more. Terraformer, we'll probably get our second core here. 
No more Hive Warrior. Nope, no pod. Well, again, without the Hive Warrior, it's not that big of a concern anymore. These two or those two? I think those two because it gets rid of the armor. armor and again the two that are left still have it so shows you what I know uh, is there a potential for a double kill by slock knock here yes he'll be on fire but he'll live I guess we could use the drop now. Gets rid of the acid on him. I think it gets rid of acid. We'll see. Also gets rid of the acid on the terraformer, I guess. Hmm. Well, I got rid of the acid. Didn't get rid of the fire, though. We'll heal in the next turn. I can't terraform up though. I, um, I also didn't get rid of the acid on you unless something attacked and I didn't know about it. So you terraform here. You're gonna be taking quite a nasty hit here. And be unable to attack. I'll never say that these guys aren't a problem. The slug log needs to repair next turn. This would kill him, I think. Because I don't know what order they move, and I'm pretty sure. He would move here, he would move here, that would count as a move and he would shoot. Unless he moves first, but the thing is, we just don't know how or what the order is for that. I guess that's just an option. Alright, 
It's all dead. You happy now, Kern? Sort of. We'll call it sort of. <clears throat> We've done our Hive Warrior already, so I think we can do this. Less than three grit, Overdriver. Overdriver is usually a cool mission. It's a terrible layout, though. Do we care about grid defense? Not really. Cataclysm it is. I don't want to leave that there for too long. Bad turn for our, all of our mechs, but we have the repair drop, I guess. I guess I'm better off that you take one damage, then we can kill. Well, prevent that thing from spawning. Oh, you don't take damage because you have self push, right? I did that. Honestly, I did. It seems. Not sure what's causing it. it. Must be a pilot then. But again, you never know, right? The whole weapon stuff was messed up by Hive Warrior. I mean, who would have guessed that? Basically, that triggered the voice line for his repair. All right, blubber boy. We're gonna have a bad turn here, but we'll 
We'll see what we can do. Generator whilst you are here. How would that look? This gets destroyed, this kills that. Yeah, this solves all of our problems, doesn't it? Were it not for the fact that the blob doesn't go first. There, we use the confused shot. You happy now? <laughs> it doesn't matter who kills him. <clears throat> oh, so it's always only two blobs. That's helpful. Actually, makes this whole ordeal doable. Um I'll take care of that blob for me. I think we're gonna take. Oh god, now a spider too. Jeez. generator on him would work yes wouldn't kill him but the shield will take care of that and then we can unfortunately not kill the boss yet at least this Spiders go. One, two, th yeah. It's a lot of deck and a lot of blobs. That's a weird place for a blob, though, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, we survived the Blob Bleeder without any collateral damage, which is one hell of a surprise. I guess the fact that he doesn't throw out three blobs anymore helps a ton. Much as I like you, Meridian, um, I don't think we need you. Could replace Locknog. And I'm not a big fan of the Deflector anyway.
What do we get? Practically no guns. Well, we'll see. Okay, so top order is probably gonna go to you. And again, I'm keeping oh, so much power gone. I guess the S projector will be put on somebody else. have a gun so you have to keep the rock launch which means everything else needs to be replaced which sucks because that means the acid projector has to go or the face cannon Now it's gonna have to be the acid projector. And the Geyer generator. What if you were to put the Geyer generator on you? That means we still need to plunk in the target strike. You got two new things, you got... The fact that these two can do a good attack, if, well, good, two damage attack. Put the acid projector here. Not much in the way of attacks, which is going to make for an interesting high warrior fight. But I guess this is how it's going to have to be. So get rid of... Yeah, we can't get rid of the acid projector. We're never going to kill the Hive Warrior. It's that simple. With his armor, it's going to be nigh impossible otherwise. Um, power. And by that I mean reputation. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Gives us two. Merp, merp. I can type. Uh, we don't really need cores right now. That doesn't mean we shouldn't stock up. So we're going to stock up on cores. I'm going to keep them around because there's no point in not doing that. We don't need to put cores into anything. Yeah, okay. That's a first. Let's leave the island. And that's going to do it for this episode. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you still enjoyed the series. Free shows, probably coming like I can or something. See you guys on the next episode. Bye, everyone.